Okay, brilliant. Well, Lord McConnell, thanks for, for joining us today. So how did you first hear about the Lake of Stars project? Well, I, I'm pretty sure I heard about Lake of Stars at, at the, right at the very beginning. And at that time, I thought it was a great idea. It's something that this part of Africa has uh, needed, you know, would benefit from for a very long time. Uh, my instincts at the time were that it would grow and grow. And sure enough, due to your hard work and the popularity uh, of the event, they, 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 those instincts have been proven to be right. Brilliant. Um, and how do you feel um, the project and the festival benefits uh, Malawi's profile, Malawi's international profile and its, uh, its development as well? well? I think it would be true to say that development is particularly hard for landlocked small countries, particularly those that have never been on the international radar. And that is certainly the case for Malawi. So a major public event of this sort that attracts young people from right across the region uh, is of huge benefit for Malawi's profile uh, and the benefits in terms of supporting local cultural uh, industries, uh, supporting the local economy in that area because of the numbers of people coming uh, are benefits that you know just would not otherwise be there. So I think Lake of Stars has been terrific, not just for the specific location but also for the country as a whole. And um, how do you, in terms of the arts um, industry, the creative industries in Malawi, how, how, do you, how do you feel that Lake of Stars um, supports that and, and the potential that Lake of Stars has to help the arts industry in Malawi really grow and develop? I think the normal instincts of most people would be, understandably, that if you're going to improve a developing country like Malawi, its economy, the quality of life for its people, then you have to get schools and health and jobs and so on, they have to get that right. Uh, but any successful economy in the world has to have a degree of dynamism about it. And much of that dynamism comes from the creative sector. And that is why it's so important, not just because of the event and the immediate impact of the numbers coming to the event, but because of the support for local artists and that whole industry. Uh, that's why this event is so important, because it will give Malawi a little bit of a cutting edge that it wouldn't otherwise have. Yeah, no, brilliant, brilliant. Uh, and last year we, we um, you know, we joined up with Wikiban, a um, mm. brilliant Scottish mm. festival, and the guys from Wikiban came over um, and you know, had a great time, and they actually helped fund some of the Malawi artists from the real rural areas in Malawi for them to take part in, um, in the festival. And we're looking at really building, developing that, that link um, you know, with, um, with the Wikiban. How do you feel um, Lake of Stars, again, with links such as that, and, and Future links to be forged with Scottish artists mm -hmm. to perform Malawi. How do you feel that Lake of Stars can support the work of the Scotland Malawi partnership? Well, so many of the, the the projects that are now under the banner of the Scotland Malawi partnership uh, first started as ideas that seemed a little bit unrealistic, perhaps a little bit unreal. Uh, and when the people from the Wickerman Festival first said to me that they would like to get involved in Lake of Stars, I thought, well, this is it. You know, it's an interesting idea, but maybe it's not going to happen. Uh, and of course it has, and it's happened quickly. And I am delighted about that. And uh, it is from those small acorns that you know, huge projects can, can ultimately grow. And I hope that the collaboration between Lake of Stars and the Wicker Man Festival is just the start of a collaboration between the artists and the whole arts industry in Malawi and artists in the arts industry in Scotland. It will be terrific. Uh, if we can see further collaborations like this in the years to come, they will benefit not just Malawi, but there'll be a huge benefit to Scotland and our cultural development too. Perfect, brilliant. And uh, you haven't been to the festival yet, no. but, but hopefully you can come out you know, this year or in the, in the future years. Have you got any plans to come and join us? Well, I have this list in my head of <laughs> things I have yet to do in Malawi and Lake of Stars creeps up that list every year and Fantastic. hopefully at some stage I'm going to make it to the festival and enjoy it like everyone else. Brilliant. Brilliant.